Hello everyone, today I'm here with Pam, Hello. our creative director, and she's going to explain to us how to make a stir fried chicken with Thai herbs. So I'm going to try and say it in Thai. Say, Gai Pad Samun Pai. Yes, it's going. Good. Good. <laughs> okay, so we're going to start by looking at all the ingredients and we're going to look at their health benefits. So we've got ginger, red chilli, we've got onion, lemongrass, turmeric and Thai basilic. Okay, so now we're going to go through the medicinal benefits that we've got. So ginger, so the ginger is here, yeah. yeah. So this is fresh ginger and it helps, so really clotting, colic. It helps with the blood circulation as well. Okay, so, and we've got Thai basilic. It smells beautiful. Yes. So it's, it relieves gas, it's colic, helps to create red blood, blood cells and prevents anemia. Is that right, Pam? Yeah. Okay, next, what do we have on the ingredients list? Lemongrass. Lemongrass. So this helps. So yeah, this is chopped up and this yeah. is fresh. Right, okay, so we, this helps lower cholesterol. It's very important. It helps reduce high blood pressure and helps remove toxins from the body. And last but not least, turmeric. Now, turmeric has many benefits, but one of the most uh, beneficial is that it's anti-cancer and prevents toxins, yeah? yeah? So, helps with toxins. Okay, so what are we gonna start with first? What are we gonna do, Pam? So we're going to start, what was that? That's the garlic. That's garlic, okay. And then we stir fry everything together. Garlic. Okay, so we put everything together. Yeah. Onion. So this is a simple dish you can do at home. Yeah. Onion, and we've got lemongrass all together. We cook them a little. Yeah, so you cook them, them yeah. ingredients first. So what we put in there was the, the garlic, the ginger, and the lemongrass. Yeah. That's just already smelling. Yes. Yeah. It's so nice, yeah. Yes, yes. You can add the, the chicken breast. So we've got the chicken breast here. Yeah. So would you say this is for one person or? Yeah, for one person. One but person. Fifty gram of the Yeah, it depends if you're yeah. foodie. So we, after cooking those three ingredients first, we add the chicken in. So you see that Pam had a bowl of chicken. She hasn't used it all, so. For one person, this should be yeah. enough. Okay, great. Next, next we have the red chili. Okay, so we're gonna have the red chili in. These are for people that like spicy foods, then, yeah? This is a spicy yeah. dish. Okay, but so. This one is not so. Not so, so spicy? Like okay. So after you cook it, it's not yeah. too spicy. Yeah. Okay. But again, if you don't like spices, you can do this dish. Like a paprika? Yeah, something. you can use paprika yeah. or something else. You don't have to okay. use chili. Okay. Now what we've got, what's this? Uh, sauce, soja sauce and oyster sauce. Soya sauce, okay. And what was the second sauce? Soya uh, sauce, oyster? Oyster sauce, yes. Oyster and soya sauce, okay. So you see in the side of the bowl, mixed together. Turmeric. Turmeric, in it goes. That's to get rid of our toxins. A little sugar. That's a little bit of sugar, okay. Yeah. So we've got some white sugar. And uh, black pepper. Ah, black pepper. And we see we're just mixing them all together. The pan has to be hot, yeah? Uh, medium. Medium, yeah, okay. Burn. So it doesn't burn yeah. medium. After you add some the water. A little bit of water to add to it, okay? Yeah. To keep it, the sauce yeah. mixed together. You can put the high, high heat, then you add some water. Okay, so when you add the water, change it to high heat. Yeah. Oh, this is starting to smell really nice now. Yeah. In the eggs. We so we turn the heat down a little bit, yeah? Yes. And now we add the spring onion. And the Thai basilic. Thai basilic, okay. And there we go. So that's all the ingredients mixed all together. So you put in last the Thai basilic and the spring onions to keep them... Not to cook long time. Yeah. Keep the, the flavor and the color. Yes. Okay. So we need some. So now it's done. Yeah. And there we have it. A little bit of decoration, a little bit of Thai basilic for decoration.
there we go. And that was just a simple dish that was done in less than five minutes or eight minutes. Not many ingredients. We need just a pan and that's it. You can bring Bunchu to your home. So there you have it. Eight minutes. Thank you, Pam. You, know, you now know how to make a stir fried chicken with Thai herbs. I won't say it again in time because it was probably embarrassing. So <laughs> thank you very much for watching and thank you very much Bye -bye. for our creative director here at Bunchu. See you Bye. soon.